Hey everyone, you're about to watch a video that's going to get thousands of views. Very cool, but your ad needs to be right here. Give me a call. The Kentucky House of Representatives unanimously passed House Bill 544 Thursday, March 10th. This bill will help regulate the production and sale of hemp-derived cannabinoid Delta-8 THC in Kentucky. You just started seeing overnight, one week it would be called this company, that company it would change their name, it'd be this. And that's what we started seeing. You know, not saying everybody, every company out there is doing the wrong things, but I can tell you if... Uh, one thing sells for $40 and then the gas station selling them for 10 and you got people saying, well, I can get it for 10 there. How much testing goes into that gas station product? How many COAs they got laying across the table? How many places they actually ID in and not selling to the kids? The vapes, I'm not talking about Delta, but the vapes, the Delta 8, all of this, it's got to be restrictions. Should the bill be signed into law, the Kentucky Cabinet for Health and Family Services will be tasked with writing administrative regulations for the production and sale of Delta 8 products in the state. Restrictions are important because of we know what is in these products. We have to know. We don't want anything being gave nor however to someone that would hurt them. We have to have to know is there hard metals, is there this, we hear of people overdosing on some contaminants of Delta-8 or whatever the contaminants is. This makes sure, as Kentucky's concerned, that you are complying with the law that they made into law where it states you're going to have to have a list of stuff. You know, other states have done that. It's about keeping it safe. Keeping it out of the hands of kids, keeping it out of the hands of people that don't need this product. The bill will now head to the Senate for consideration. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.